Hello YouTube, we are here in my country, Philippines. Those outlets, same as the US, Japan, Taiwan, and it's um, two prongs. Some, the, most of the Philippines uses US style two prong outlets. And some of them have round holes, which is a European outlet. And some of them have flat but three prong outlet or three pin outlet. Speaking of the three pin, um, they're setting uh, this is the type 8 outlet and with the holes called type B with two pin as in three pin outlet type B US and for type C which is the um, four millimeter round European outlet and EF which is the European very very thick 4.8 millimeter outlet and also the Thailand uses type O which is uh, round same as the US ground pin outlet let me let us try to measure, measure the voltage in the Philippines be careful Americans or Canadians check the voltage yeah I already bought this thing from Lazada or eBay or Amazon digital AC voltmeter instead of bringing multimeter put in your carry-on or just put check me um carry oh sorry uh, check this voltage never mind about that a uh, voltage is yes. look 226 volts 220 to 30, 230 volts raise up to 227 volts as well okay unplug this first okay for the frequency most of uh, Europe uses 220 volts and 50 Hertz US North America Canada Mexico uses 120 volts and 60 Hertz and Japan uses East Japan uses 100 uh, volts and 50 Hertz West Japan uses 100 volt and 60 Hertz okay if you're planning to bring your US 110 volt hair clipper with step down transformer from 220 to 110 without any use in inverting for any 60 hertz countries if you're really, um, in 50 hertz countries like thailand you have to plug the ac multi voltage to 1 volt dc to 1 volt dc to 110 60 hertz inverter check this uh, thingy here check this not 50 hertz but 60 hertz 60.2 hertz here in the philippines um uses 60 hertz the rest of the southeast asia uses 50 hertz all right so let me demonstrate you this thing okay this is the thing that two pin outlet to three pin three pin us just like this okay let me show you this three pin see this three pin same as the US and Canada okay let me plug the Hertz meter and the voltmeter as well okay Philippines voltage and frequency uses 230 volts and 60 Hertz some houses in the Philippines operates 240 volts as well and some of the houses uses 230 to 220 220 to 240 volts same okay and also the 60 Hertz on our country's frequency or cycles 220 volts and 60 Hertz don't forget if you use the if, if this uh, Hertz meter reads 50 Hertz okay you have to purchase an inverter for your uh, clock as well and for hair, US hair clipper 60 Hertz hair clipper 60 Hertz best better than 50 Hertz so most um, 220 volt hair clippers runs normally and operates normally at 60 Hertz